Good day, good day! <laughs> How the honk are you? Welcome to Roverland! This is your friend Dan Owen. I got a subject for you today. What is the oldest Land Rover ever? Oldest Land Rover toy ever? What toy? I'm trying to track it down. I want your opinion. That's you. What do you think the oldest Land Rover toy is out there? Model. Yes. What do you think? I, um... I've been uh, going around kicking this around, and uh, I thought I'd revisit this. I, I did a, a video a long time ago about this. Um, Husky, put out 1964 to 1965, somewhere around there. Not the oldest. No, we're going to put that back there. You guys remember this? This is the uh, Matchbox. Let's get it in focus here. Oh, I had it upside down. This one, no, I didn't. I had it right side up. This is the uh, Matchbox, and this one's got boogers all over it. Matchbox series number 12. But you know what? Yeah, this is the first one of that one. Yeah, the second version of that. Um, yeah, 1965. That, uh, that's the uh, C. I think that, yeah, that, I, that, I don't know. Anyway, this one was the next one. Yeah. This was in the 60s. I still got this upside down. <laughs> Not the oldest. Yeah. Uh, what did I say that came out? Yeah. Anyway, I don't think I got that one wrote down because that's not the oldest. This is one of the latest ones of that. This is the uh, super fast. Uh, this is kind of one of the last ones that they ever really produced uh, for Matchbox. Not the oldest. Yeah, so let's get those out of the way. That was just kind of filler there. We're going to go with what may be thought as the oldest one. Um, that's this one here. Yes, this is the Matchbox number 12B, which has Land Rover Series 3 on it. Now, this one is the black-wheeled one. Uh, these were produced since uh, 1959 to 1965. Oh, that's getting pretty old. And you would think, well, here's a gray-wheeled one. That one's got to be older yet. No, this one was in 1964 to 1965 that's the they put this one out i don't know how come i got such a nice one but that is not it so that was the matchbox number 12 b so that's why i called that one c because uh yeah that was the number 12 safari number c all right well let's see let's see uh let this one might be the next one right the dinky diablo toys now, Diablo was for the double O scale, the railroad scale. And this is the number uh, 07 tree. This one also came, well, you'd have to buy it, but a horse and trailer would, uh, horse and a, a horse trailer would go with this and it would fit really nicely on that rear hitch. Now, this one, uh, 19. 1958. Now this has kind of got like metal plastic. Well, this one's I think plastic wheels. Plastic wheels. Plastic wheel on top. Nice cute little thing. Now the Dablo Dablo was launched in 57 but didn't hit the stores till 1958. So this could be a 1958. Now that's pretty old. That's pretty old. Is that the oldest? Well, maybe not so much. It's the smallest right now. <laughs> How about this one? This is the Morestone SS number three. Now, mine has been customized very heavily. <laughs> this is the yellow model, which uh, is the uh, 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 road assistant. You can see road service there, the double A road assistant. Uh, been customized by uh, a lad, but I got one. Uh, these are metal wheels as far as I know. Yep, metal wheels made in English. This is the, like I said, SO number three. 
1956 to 58, they say. Well, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Very primitive, very cool. Is this the oldest one? Hmm, 1956. Well, it's a little bit bigger than that one, so it's got to be older, right? I don't know. <laughs> All right, how about this one? I got two of these buggers. This is the Dinky Toy number, what is this? Uh, well, and uh, the Mecco Limited, made in England. This is the 255. And, um, yeah, metal, 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 except for it does have some rubber wheels on it. This is the Mercy uh, Tunnel. You see the police. Very nice. I'm not really sure how I got two of them, but I got two of them. This one I don't believe has got the original wheels on it. These are uh, smooth wheels. I think the uh, the ones with the little tread on them, I think those are original. But uh, yeah, I think I, I paid a little bit of money for these. Uh, these are all on eBay. But uh, what do you think? What year? 1955 to 61. So this one is uh, older yet. Interesting, interesting. Well, I think there's one more that's a little bit older, I think. I'm, I'm waiting for your guys' comments in the comments below. Hey, if you like this video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Whoa, this is an old thumb. Not as old as these buggers, but <laughs> give me a thumbs up. Subscribe. You got to subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. All right. So, we had the uh, 12C, we had the 12B from Matchbox, we had the uh, Dinky Diablo toy, 1958, okay, we had the Esses, 1956 to 1958, and then we had the uh, Dinky toy number 255, 1955, they made this till 1961. Well, there was one more that I think beat it out. Look at this example that I have of it, huh? Beautiful. <laughs> okay, this was a remanufacturer of the original. This is, uh, yeah, this is a replica from Matchbox. This is not it. I don't, I don't, I can't even remember what year they came out with, but this is not it. <laughs> That's it. So we have, ladies and gentlemen, the Matchbox number 12A. Let's take a look at this one. This is right now. Mine are all missing. I, this is the only two I got. Mine are all missing the dude. There's a little tan dude that's supposed to be like that in these cars, and I don't have them. So this is the Matchbox number 12A. It says Lindsay on there. If we can get it in focus, Lindsay, England, yes. Now this one's got a little little damage there. We hit that. Oh, you know, I think on the real cars too, they hit those wings and they don't survive too well. So these are uh, little uh, plastic wheels here. I think this one's plastic. Yeah, those are plastic too. And you can see where the driver goes in. Uh, very, very nice. This is probably the cleanest one I've got. Um, very sh simple, very straightforward. This would be the Series 1. I don't know if it's the Huey 166, but uh, here's one that's a little bit more worse, worn for wear. Uh, I believe they're the same uh, thing. This one's just a little bit worn for wear. Uh, yeah. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful little things. Now, these, per se, um, these, now get a hold of it. Now, what did we, well, the last we left off, 1955 to 61 was that. And this one here, they say Matchbox produced these from 1955 to 1958. The number 12 a there you go so i think we've kind of got kind of a, a toss up here between this little bugger 
and this one here. They came out in the same year. What do you think would be the oldest one? Not sure. I mean, this one is it came out, out a year later. This one, two years later. But there you go. These, I think, are some of the oldest Land Rover models that are out there today. Yes. Um, I'm not really sure. I'm not really uh, going to... I, I think this one was the first one that ever was uh, released to the public and is the oldest Land Rover model out there, toy, toy model out there, starting at 1955. Now, Land Rover started in 1948, so it took them six years, is that right? Eight, nine, ten, that's two, and seven years, seven years to get these out? Unbelievable, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> well, there you go. This is a look at what would be, what is your opinion, the oldest Land Rover toy made by a major, you know, manufacturing toy company. And my guess is would be the Matchbox number 12A, 1955. All right, like I said, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe, come on over to Facebook to Roverland channel. And, uh... Roverland at Facebook and then um, come on over to Instagram Roverland channel Alrighty, that's it for me today As always remember slow traffic keep right and have a great Rover day